everybody, it's Sunny from Vegan Beauty Review and today I wanted to review another snack box. This one I have actually never tried before. It's from a company called Earthbox. That's Earthbox with a U. <laughs> and um, this is their small size box which goes for $19.95 which has 12 plus snacks. It's actually packed. It seems really full. It seems like there, there's actually more in there, but um, I'm hungry. <laughs> Let's dive in already. Seriously, I know I've said this in previous videos, but um, I enjoy getting snack boxes probably more than I do getting anything else in the mail because A, I love food <laughs> a little too much, um, and B, it's just nice to switch things up a little because I review so many beauty products. Okay, where do I start? You know what, let me start with the savory and then I'll, I'll move forward to the, um, the sweet. Um, okay, so I'm gonna start with this. This is Unique Brand Pretzel Shells. Pretzel, pretzel shells, that's interesting. I wonder if there are people that only like the outside crunchy bits. And it says all crunch, no filling, more flavor, fewer ingredients, smarter baking. Okay, oh and by the way, everything in Earthbox is vegan. It even says that on this card. I don't know if they're exclusively vegan. I'm under the impression they are, but I will verify that and then I'll also include that information down below in the info box and on my blog. Mm. Okay, so let's try these. I mean, I don't think there's a lot of mystery here because I kind of know what pretzels taste like. But, oh wow, they really are just the outside crusties. Like, how do they even bake these? Do they have these little, like, elves scooping out the insides? Like, how do they do that? <clears throat> so anyways, that's what that looks like. Look at that. It looks like a normal pretzel, right? Mm-mm. Psych. <laughs> How they do that? That's kind of tripping me out. I think it's funny that it says all crunch, no filling because I don't know, pretzel, pretzels are pretty much 100% crunchy throughout, but this is, it's a nice sensation in the mouth to feel it kind of sort of collapse. That's good, that's good. Okay, next up. Oh, ha <laughs> I was like, I'm gonna start with the savory. There's a lot of sweet stuff up in here, so I guess I'll just mix it up. This is Jessica's Organic Vanilla Syrup. Um, how do you use this? It's great in milk, coffee, iced tea, on pancakes, in oatmeal, uh, smoothies, yogurt, and ice cream. Well, that sounds good. I love vanilla. I wonder if it's like naturally sweet in there and like no ingredients on here whatsoever. Um, I'm not gonna slurp this on camera. <laughs> Uh, but ooh, on pancakes or oatmeal, it's probably how I'm gonna rock this. I like the little cow on there, that's cute. Okay, next up we have, ah, here's some savory. <clears throat> Rice chips from uh, Lundberg brand. These are sea salt and it's made with organic grains. Uh, yeah, lots of organic ingredients, that's good. Delicious brown rice crunch. I'm assuming these are like soy free, gluten free, yeah, gluten free right here. Okay, let's try it out. <laughs> It's always embarrassing like not being able to open these while I'm filming because it's like, girl, you weak. <laughs> it's just because I need fuel. I need to eat, right? Oh my god, there's like two chips in here. Do you see that? <laughs> I mean, I know that's pretty standard for chip bags, but this seems especially cray, right? <laughs> Anyways, let's try these out. Again, they're made out of brown rice. Oh, they taste very like wholesome and you know honestly they just taste like um tortilla chips like almost identical i don't even notice the difference but they're gluten-free which is the difference right these are good these are good um so far i haven't been like wowed by anything per se but everything is you know tasty let's see Okay, now we have this Cafix All Natural Instant Beverage. Oh, it's 100% naturally caffeine free. Mmm, okay. That's good, although I have been incorporating caffeine into my life lately via matcha. <laughs> um, so let's see what's in here. <clears throat> As roasted barley, chicory, malt, figs, and red beet concentrate. Is that really all it has? If desired, add milk. Oh, this sounds really interesting. 
I'm not, I don't understand if it's like an all natural energy caffeine free boost or what. I'll have to keep you guys posted on this. This is intriguing. I will have to <clears throat> dive into that a little bit further. Next we have uh, Fruities. I love these like little slurpy pouches because they're great for when you're on the go and you're in a rush and you don't have time to like have real breakfast. Um, this is made with one half cup of fruits and veggies. It's California grape. Um, and it says totally vegan right on the package right there. Ooh, we like that. Um, so yeah, kale and grape. Sounds interesting. And I like that they don't add sugar. I'll be trying this out. <laughs> I'm not going to do that right now. Um, <clears throat> what do we have here? Big slice pure kettle cooked, kettle cooked apples. Kettle cooked apples. My brain is trying to process that because when I hear kettle cooked, I usually think of those little like crispy, crunchy chips that are like, um, let's see, sliced apples, water, blueberries, pomegranate juice, just different kinds of juice. Okay, this is interesting. Oh, it's really gushy. I'm scared to open it. And it's under 100 calories? It says under 100 calories. <laughs> okay, I feel like I need a fork or something. Okay, whatever, I'm just gonna open it. I'm scared. Whoa, what a trip. And that's what it looks like on the inside. You know what? I'm going to get a spoon. Okay, you guys. So this is what it looks like. It almost looks like preserves or something. <clears throat> that's, I, that's what it looks like. And this whole thing only has 80 calories, which sounds good. No fat, too. Mmm. Oh, man, that's good. Mmm. So these are cooked with blueberry and pomegranate and I can taste all those flavors in here oh my god that's so good okay so far this is my favorite out of the bunch oh my god that's so good mm. Mm -hmm. okay I'll finish that after I'm done recording <laughs> um okay, what do we have next we have <clears throat> organically grown Red tart cherries straight from the farm. All good provisions, I think, is the name of the brand. Sun dried and sweetened. Oh my god, my favorite fruit, I think, is cherries, or one of my favorite fruits. Um, so I'm excited about this. Sun dried and sweetened. Let's see what it's sweetened with. Da 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 da. Ingredients dried organic tart cherries, organic sugar, and organic sunflower oil. Yeah. I have still been, since I made my last snack box video, I'm still trying to cool it on the sugar. I mean, I went out of town last week and I didn't cool it on the sugar, but now that I'm back, I'm definitely trying to get back on track. So I'm only going to have a couple of these. Okay. They look like dried cherries. No surprise there. Mmm. 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 They have a little like little tart little zing that kind of takes a while to sink in all those are good mm. you know how i like to think of it i mean those these have sugar in them they are fruit so this is maybe a better alternative than eating a straight up piece of cake i'd rather they didn't have sugar in there but this is an okay like cheat treat you know what i mean mm, those are so good <laughs> mm. wow okay <laughs> Next up, we have Welch's Family Farm. Oh, okay, this is weird that they have such a mainstream conventional brand. And the Earth Box, I was not expecting that. 80 calories per bag, triple fruit treat, dried mango, cranberries, and blueberries. It's just dried berries. It does have sulfur dioxide and sugar, added sugar. <clears throat> Again, weird that they went with this brand, but whatever. So nothing crazy, just like dried fruit, right? I'll try a little piece of mango. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And a cranberry. And a blueberry. That's nice. So there's a lot of fruit in here, which is pretty impressive. I'm liking all the fruit. Not a lot of like sinful snacks where it's like, oh, I hate myself. <laughs> I just ate like five pounds of fat. Like none of that. None of that. Mm. This is interesting. Inspired by simplicity, this is 
I'm not sure how how that said sap or sap. Um, it's nettle. It's a nettle beverage with no added sugars. It's high in manganese. Um, <clears throat> has 80% less uh, sugar than coconut water. Uh 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 um. Okay, it says it ta the taste is light, sweet, and woody, naturally filtered by birch trees. Okay, this sounds really cool. Um, I'm gonna try a sip, but I usually like to have my beverages chilled or iced, so um, I'm just gonna try it to let you guys know how it is, but I'll drink the whole thing later. The ingredients are just organic birch sap, 99.8%, organic nettle, and citric acid. Okay, I like how simple that is. Okay, here we go, cheers! <laughs> Mmm. I like I like the unique flavor. It does taste it does taste woody. So much for me trying it. I can't even put into words what it tastes like. It tastes very earthy and like lightly sweet. It's nice. It's delicate. It feels good going down. I like it. Okay, next we have, let's see, original for no guilt naked nature dark chocolate. I like the packaging. This is non-GMO verified, made in the USA. There's a little tooth on it. I'm, I wonder if that means it's like, aha, <clears throat> it has xylitol from birch tree, which means that's the sweetener they're using. So I think that's why it has the tooth on there. It won't cause tooth decay because there's no like sugar sugar in it. Okay, I'm just gonna try a tiny, tiny piece because again, I'm trying to be good. Um, let me show you what it looks like. Oh, sorry, I broke off a piece already. Da -da 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 -da. All right, here we go. Mm. I'm not the world's biggest fan of dark chocolate, but that's I. Right. It's you know it's a little too sophisticated for me. <laughs> I like things that are a little more obviously sweet and like blatantly like I'm sugary and la la la. <laughs> that's good, not my favorite, but it's good. Okay, next is the cookie department. They have this grateful vegan sweet potato wellness cookie. A wellness cookie, what a cute idea. This seems like it'd be really kid friendly. Um, this all natural cookie contains sweet potatoes and cranberry is a good source of antioxidants. <clears throat> Let's see, it's got two grams of protein. Be grateful every day, la la. Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna read it. <laughs> Ain't got time for that. I'm hungry. Okay, here we go. <laughs> this is what it looks like. Mm. It has like a falsy, like there's spices in here. There is. There's ground cinnamon and um, nutmeg. Ooh. Me gusta. That is good. That is damn good. Okay. Next up, what do we have here? Organic Chickpeatos. All these companies have such cute names and I like this vegan right on the back. Where is it, right here? Ta-da, V for vegan. It's just organic chickpeas, organic olive oil, rosemary salt, and orga organic garlic powder. Um, this is from Watusi Foods is the brand and it's rosemary flavored, so. I like me some chickpeas, so I'm pretty sure I'll like this one. These are so hard to open. Hang on. Okay. <clears throat> That's what they look like. Little chickpeas. Mmm. Mmm. Very rosemary and garlicky. I like that. Mmm. <laughs> Those are good. Two thumbs up. And last, but not least, we made it to the bottom, is um, this chewy granola bar from Ernest Eats. It's superfood trail mix. Um, yeah, let's just try it, let's try it out. <laughs> I like granola bars, especially the chewy kind, not so much the crunchy kind, but let's see. This, is, this one's a chewy one. In a mess. Okay.
Oh, that is nice. It has superfood grains, oats, amaranth, quinoa. It's vegan, gluten-free, and all natural. That's good. Okay, I'm going to go over my favorites with y'all. This cookie, definitely one of my favorites. I would say this is one of my favorites. The chickpeas were pretty bomb. And this, uh, like, sludgy yumminess of the uh, kettle baked, I'm sorry, kettle cooked apples with blueberries and pomegranates. These are the Uber winners. Super yummy. Um, this is like a honorable mention. Um, I'm sure it'll taste even better chilled, but I like the unique flavor. Um, and everything else was just kind of, it was good, but not like blow me away great. Um, so this box is $19.95. They have smaller boxes, bigger boxes, different price points. I will go ahead and post all that below. Um, let me know if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, make sure to subscribe and I'll, I'll try to feature more foodie snacks because it's nice to know that we vegans have like a million options. Um, that's it for now. Let me know if you guys have any questions and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.